Philip Shaibu, who arrived at the construction site in company of other government functionaries, was taken round the about 20,000 capacity stadium by the site engineer. Supporting front lights, where will it be? On the same front or where? The front light is at the back, but the, uh, the scoreboard is going to be on the facade. He expressed satisfaction with the work done so far, despite the weather condition. Explaining that plans had been concluded to tap from the grassroots talents. Uh, we have timeline in completion of this stadium, and that is why I've just come to check the progress the contractor is making. And if you check what this stadium, you see the aesthetics that we are putting are going to encourage private sector investment in terms of advert, in terms of just name it. Same with the other stadium we are doing. And at the end of the day, there will be a destination for sports. Site engineer says the pitch is FIFA certified and the track has a 50-year warranty. He adds that the work will be completed before the end of December. The pitch you're going to get is the best you can get anywhere. We, we have already drained the nursery planting. And if you are back in another two or three months, you'll see the grass up. I can assure you that. Away from the reconstruction site, the deputy governor was at the University of Benin Sports Complex for the morning training session with the better insurance team ahead of its crucial match slated for September 12. He encouraged the players to be disciplined and hard working to meet the club's target of gaining promotion in the Nigerian Professional Football League. Mr. Governor is determined to give everything that we need for us to succeed. Yeah, so I'm sure nobody's owed any salary. No, Has anybody no. been owed salary? No, no, sir. Bender Insurance is currently topping Group B and will lock horns with Gateway Football Club of Shogo in the Nigerian National League future on League Resumption Day on September 12th in Benin. Elizabeth Owotomo, NTN News.